from Shenandoah, from Page County, from KMA Land. This is KMA News Headlines. Good afternoon, I'm Mike Peterson with the latest from the KMA Newsroom on this Tuesday afternoon. Renewed discussion over a proposed carbon pipeline project dominated Tuesday morning's Montgomery County Board of Supervisors meeting. During the public comment period, local residents once again called for the supervisors to approve an ordinance regulating carbon capture projects, such as Summit Carbon Solutions proposed Midwest Express CO2 pipeline. Last July, the supervisors approved a resolution not to take action on a proposed ordinance after Summit sued Shelby County for taking similar action. A federal court judge in December barred Shelby and Story counties from enforcing their pipeline ordinances. Despite public comments, no action was taken by the board. Once once was a dilapidated gas station is now the site of a major housing project in Shenandoah. Ribbon cutting ceremonies take place Wednesday morning at 1130 at the Shenandoah Senior Villa Apartment Complex at 1401 West Sheridan Avenue. Occupation of the 40-foot apartment complex for residents 55 and over took place earlier this year following the facility's completion. Shenandoah City Council paved the way for the project's fruition by approving a development agreement for North Star LLC in December 2022. That same month, crews demolished an old gas station standing at that location to pave way for the project's construction. Shenandoah School Superintendent Dr. Kerry Nelson expects repairs to the district's K-8 building to be completed in chunks. More discussion regarding proposed repairs to the more than 20-year-old facility took place during a Shenandoah School Board work session following the regular meeting late Monday afternoon. Speaking on KMA's Morning Line program this morning, Nelson says repairs to the building's heating and air conditioning system and heat pumps are considered priorities. KMA on track weather, mostly sunny this afternoon. Highs in the upper 80s. Tonight, mostly clear. Lows in the mid-60s. Tomorrow, Sunday with a high in the low 90s. More news at 5.05 and 6.05 this evening and online at kmaland.com. Have a great rest of your Tuesday. Mike Peterson, so long, my friend.